Hi, this is King David, David and Goliath Music, dngmusiconline.com, bclass.com. And uh, this is going to be a quick tutorial showing you how to fix uh, timing for rap vocals in Foodie Loops or FL Studio. Uh, okay, so I have a line. I segmented it for you to make it easy for you to focus in. And it's just this one line, and it's a little bit off. You ever do a whole line, but there's just that one part that's not quite right. And you want to fix it, but you don't want to record it again. So here's what the deal is. Listen to it. Young boy, eight, yeah. Young boy, eight, yeah. And some people will be satisfied with that. Uh, me, personally, my professional opinion, I'm not satisfied. Young boy, eight, young boy, eight. So what we want to do is, uh, first of all, we can zoom out, but then zoom back in. And realize that there's a specific section young boy, eight, yeah. where that sound or where that timing is off. So we have to then isolate that section alright and then we have to visually see it on the screen so that we can see exactly why it's off timing so it's not just um, a guesswork here we can actually we can see first of all by identifying which channel it is if you're not sure which channel it is mute the channel and then you'll hear that it disappears and that'll let you know that those are the channels see alright so now let's select the portion or the the area where the audio needs to be fixed using uh, um, our select tool now we're working in the playlist so make sure that this, this is only going to occur in the playlist and if you're recording vocals you need to be using the ASIO driver okay so next thing once we've identified the area that we need to fix what we need to do then is to use the right tools. One is going to be the slice tool. And we can see, if, as we're looking on the screen, we can see exactly where it's off. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to slice the portion here uh, that's right before uh, the break in the audio. So we can see that this audio is ahead. So I don't want to match this one to the one. Uh, the first audio match the second to the first audio so what I'm going to do is go to uh, my quantize or my snap to I'm going to make sure it's set to uh, uh, to the main the main is going to be set to line I'm going to again take my slice tool and I'm going to slice the audio that I need to fix and then I'm going to do it again I'm going to cut out the little area. There we go. Now, I want to go ahead now and do that same slice on the other side of the audio, in the beginning of the audio. So that I can move it. So just one slice there. And now I can slide this around any way I like. So I can match it up a little bit tighter. Alright, I'll play it back. Young boy, eight, young, young boy, eight, young boy, eight. Much better, isn't it? Now listen to the original. Young boy, eight, young, young boy, eight, young. See? Now I can actually move it around, slide it. Young boy, eight, young boy, eight. And I'm actually more happy with that than I was in the original. Alright, so this is King David for David and Goliath Music. This is a quick, really quick tutorial on how you can match up your vocals, uh, your rap vocals in Fruity Loops or FL Studio. Um, and without having to record again, all right? King David, David Goliath Music, peace.